Well, hello to my YouTube friends out there. I am back. Wow, today is Saturday. And I wasn't going to come on and do a video, but I went and purchased something that I was after since it launched on the 15th. And it's by Too Faced. Also, I want to share some other little things with you guys and talk to you guys a little bit. I hope everyone is doing well today. God is good. You know, we're all blessed that we're able to buy these things, makeup and all this other good stuff. But the first thing I want to get out of the way that I have been talking about is this robe that came on Wendy Williams. It was, you know, she does this fashion um, review on her show. And I love Wendy Williams. So she keeps you up on everything. One of these days I will be going on the show because I love going to New York. So that's my next thing is to be in that audience so I can meet me some Wendy. So anyway, this is the robe right here. And it's pronounced Masani Home. Um, but it's, it's yeah, it's through the company of Masani Home. Now, this robe, I'm going to tell you guys, this robe was $398, but actually I did not pay that amount. I got it because they had it on a clearance because it was on Wendy. And it was like $105, $107, something like that. So anything with hoods on it, I like. So I wanted to share with you guys, and this is how it comes, in a zipper. And I'm going to have to fold it back up again, but that's okay. I'm going to do it for you guys. But the texture of this robe is amazing. Um, it's long, as you guys can see, um, and it has a hood. This is what it looks like. Wow, this is kind of hard. But it has a hood on the back. This is how it is. And this is the print. And Wendy has the same, and has, ooh, these pockets. I love the pockets on each side of the row. Let's see, where is that? Okay. Let's see, where is this thing here? Okay. And actually, when she wore the robe, she wore it on the plane. She wore it to the studio. And it was really, really cute. So, you guys, if you want to check it out, if you're a Wendy Williams fan like I am, check it out and see because she's wearing it all over the place. And it's and it's a fashion robe. Um, you guys got to excuse me. I'm trying to <laughs> get myself together here. Okay. Um, I'm on my way to go see my mom. And she had another fall. But she's okay. She was going to the restroom and slipped in the bathroom. She kind of hurt her shoulder a little bit. And this happened on Thursday night. They called me like 1 o'clock in the morning and to let me know that my mom had a slip and fall. So I just, I don't know. You know, when you're high risk for falls like that, you got to be monitored quite well. And my mom, she's very stubborn, and she'll try to do whatever she can to be independent. And that's why I have to get on her about. But anyway, let me get into what I purchased yesterday. When I got off work, I went to Sephora, and I got the Too Faced Hangover RX 3-in-1 spray. Now, it's silicone-free, it's alcohol-free, and it's oil-free. And it says, we love your skin even when you don't. Now, I have the cream of this um, um, when it came out with the primer. I have three. Actually, I have one. I have two. I have one in the box I haven't used, and I got one that I'm working on. Whoa, this spray. Now, I'm going to tell you guys the claims of this spray. This is the box right here. And it is... Prime, it sets and it refreshes your skin at the same time. Now, this is what it claims on here. It says that it is 100% um, falsement, falsalentment. I don't know what they mean by that, but anyway, I'll, this smoother. <laughs> okay, it's 100% smoother, 100% hydrated, 100% didn't transfer. And 100% flawless. <clears throat> I need to tell you guys about this. I was in the store. And they sprayed it on my skin. And it was really, really wet. Like, whoa, a burst of mist on your face. It took a minute to dry. I hadn't even put no powder on my face. I had just went into the store because I knew what I wanted. And it just hydrated really, really well. I'm wearing it today. With my Estelada, 
Um, and I noticed that when, even though they tell you to spray in the center of the face and it burst out, I did that. And wow, it really wets your skin. I like, I like it wets it, but you got to wait until it dries down. And once it dries down, it's going to be like a tacky feeling on the skin. And then once it dries, you're going to see that it's ready for you to do what you need to do as far as putting on your foundation. Boy, 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 boy. Afterwards, when I spray, it was the same thing. It tells you to shake it up really, really well before, after you do your um, primer. But the thing is, I use my Stila um, glitter on my eyes over the top of my eyeshadow, and it wet it up. So the, I, the thing is, I think that you need to spray your face first if you're going to use any type of glitter or anything like that because it's going to wet it up and then it's going to like disappear. So I suggest spray your face, do all that, and then go in with this. It's really, really nice. Now, the ultimate test for me is to see how long it lasts. It's supposed to last quite a bit of time. It's supposed to hold your makeup on. One thing I can say, I can feel that it locked my make makeup in. I can feel it being tacky on my skin. That it really catches it. It catches the foundation like you don't want. Like, like it's unbelievable. Like the like when it stays, you can feel that it's staying. Um, I use my skin to navy. That's my favorite. That's my holy grail. I will always keep using that forever. Now. Let me get into this other product that I bought. I had a breakout. Not bad. Here, right up in here and over here. I went to Ulta and I bought the Acne Control Rapid Relief Acne Spot Treatment. This is what it looks like. It comes in a tube. Amazing. Amazing, amazing. It claims that it reduces blemishes size and redness within four hours and it did i had one of those ones where it hurt underneath the skin and you can feel it when it penetrates this stuff really really works i told one of my co-workers about it and she went immediately and got it actually you can see the tube i've been using it because i had one over here and then i had one over here oh and it hurts so bad but this right here the murad it really really helped Today, I am wearing on my lips, I am wearing Jeffree Star, Belores Day. He came out with a new um, line, and I did purchase it this morning because it launched today. So if you guys are interested in buying Jeffree Star lipsticks, I tell you, you would be amazed because his lipsticks are very good for me. And that's all I'm going to say. Because usually when I say too much about Jeffree, I get People don't like that, but he's he's cool. I like Jeffree Star. Also, when I went to Sephora, I bought the Smashbox Lid Primer. This is my second one, and I like this because my eyelids are oily as all get out, and I be struggling for my eyeshadow to stay on, but this one is really good. Check this out, guys. I used, um, it was MAC Primer, no. I, I used two different primers on my lid that morning. I was rushing to go to work. Um, and it was one of the back collections. It was a Chinese one. I can't remember the name of it. And it was another one. And I had layered them together so that my eyeshadow can stay on. And I sprayed the coconut um, prep and prime. And my eyes burned like crazy. Like I got a rash like right here on the top lid of my eyes. Oh, it was the Urban Decay um, primer, and it just burned right up in the corner. And I was like, oh, my God, what's going on? So I can't layer two different type of concealers on my eyes because the it must be the ingredients that my skin did not like. But these are so nice, and I like the color. I like the way it stays on my eyes like a, like a concealer. Oh, my God. And then last week, I didn't bring it with me, but I bought the Anastasia um, Beverly Hills Concealer, and I'm wearing that underneath my eyes today. I like it. You just only need a little bit. It's pretty heavy. It's pretty heavy stuff. 
Also, my girl that works at Sephora, she gave me some samples of some perfumes. And I got two of the Giorgio Armani. And one she gave me called Juliet Has a Gun. Mm. Yeah, this is nice. I really, really like it. So that's pretty much it that I have to share with you guys for today. I am, you know, it's going to be in the 90s here today. It's been in the 100s here in Stockton. Um, the other day it was 110 and then it was 111. And the weather has been really, 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 really hot. And we've been running our air like nobody's business. So I love you guys out there. Thank you guys so very much for watching. Have a blessed weekend. Leave your comments down below. You know I love my comments. If you like this video, thumbs me up and hit that notification button whenever I do another video. And I will see you guys my next video. Bye.